In episode two of Angry Cake, we have most of the physics working. Uh, this is on a Linux desktop too. So I'm going to move this over onto uh, Android emulator just because it's uh, a little bit better audio when using Flame Audio. So on the GitHub repository, uh, there's this tab here for the branches. So the starting branch is 0 to linear impulse. So this is the version that's at the start of this current tutorial. The version that's at the end of the tutorial is called Collision. I forgot to put the 03 in front of it. But this one will have it working on the Android emulator with the sound. Okay, there's quite a bit of steps. So I'm going to first on the start up my Android emulator here. Okay, I have it in landscape mode right now. And I'll run it because I have the Pixel 4a uh, down here selected. So it will run uh, from the VS Code. It will run it on the emulator. Okay, it says uh, there's no Android manifest.xml, so I never actually enabled it. Okay. Flutter create platforms equals Android dot. And we'll try it again. The first problem is that even though I have the emulator sideways, the game itself is not sideways. So when I, even if I restart this game here, the, it still thinks that it's at the top. Right? So we first need to set into landscape mode. Uh, and that it's in the flame. There's a little a method utility. So above the run app, I'm in main, oops. I'm in main.dart above the run app. We'll first attempt to set force the flame game to be in landscape mode as the first step. Okay, and it's not coming up because I'm gonna do control dot. I'm gonna import the flame flame package. Previously I imported flame game.dart and now there's flame flame.dart. So at this stage, let's see what happens when I restart it. Okay, bunch of errors. What does it say? It's basically going to say that I need to put this uh, widgets flutter binding dot ensure initial initialized uh, ahead of this thing. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that. Right now with just the device dot set landscape, I can't run the application. But Let's put this widgets flutter and binding ensure initialize just to make sure the flame engine is running before we call this thing here and let's restart it. Now it's looking a little bit better, but you saw the bird just went off the screen, right? So, so a couple of problems. Oh, okay. I guess he's working now. But the, the, the scaling's off. Okay, so he is dropping down, but I think on the first one, he's going right through it, right? The aspect ratio, the different emulators, I think he's gonna go straight through it. So this is kind of a problem that we're gonna fix. Uh, also, there's this thing at the top here that I will get rid of. Let's take it through step by step. So to get rid of the overlay menu from Android, just set the device to full screen. Uh, that will take care of one of the problems, but we're, we're having a couple of problems here. So it's because I reloaded it, but in the first boot and also the the scaling's off, so let's. I'm going to use a uh, fixed resolution view viewport. 
So I'll just set the camera dot view port. This is built into the flame game. So that the aspect ratio is the same on different types of devices. So at this stage, there's still going to be some problems. But let's look at the problem so that when you encounter it yourself, you can correct it, right? So the scaling is a little bit better now, but the connection to the box 2D world or the Forge 2D world is not. So let's take a look at this thing. So I'm setting the background to size. I'm passing over uh, game size, which is from the screen to world back to the ground here. But I'm just going to set it to the size of the screen. And let's see what happens. OK, seems to be working now. I'm going to stop it and restart it. And now it works as expected. I'm going to delete the uh, screen to world here because we're not using it right now. And we're just going to use the size. The size is from the flame game system and it does uh, take into account the viewport transformation and the camera zooming. The zoom level is set to 10. So it's been uh, working for me in my tests. Right, let's set up some additional sounds and special effects. <laughs> 